It is a Sunday afternoon in Honiara, capital of the Solomon Islands, and this joyful crowd is heading towards a wedding to witness a bride price ceremony. In parts of the South Pacific Islands, the groom's family has to pay a bride price to the bride's family, usually in traditional shell money. One set of shell strings is worth a whopping thousand Salomon dollars, which results in tough negotiations among the relatives. Of course, shell money is not in circulation as a currency anymore, but apart from being the local jewelry of choice, think of it as a sort of Southern Pacific gold standard. The shells are rare and refining them into jewelry is a tedious and labor-intensive process. And the complete value chain is created by women. The rare shells are broken up in pieces, cut and grinded, and the holes are drilled with an ancient tool inside a coconut shell. And trading the shell money is a largely informal business, but these women sense that they could market the jewelry beyond their local customers. With the support of the World Bank, these women entrepreneurs are being listed and presented in widely accessible databases, which is the first step for them to get out of their backyard factory and onto the screens of merchants. We hope that even the Europeans might be interested in the shell money that we are making and marketing here. And the simple effort to broaden the sales base has the potential to create additional spending that trickles down. It does also benefit these women hundreds of miles away on a different island. Martha, Hemily, Javelin and Lena are among those venturing out with their canoes to hidden lagoons where they can find the rare shells in muddy waters, spending all day looking for them under a scorching sun. We have to use our legs and fill the cells in the mud. It is certainly not easy money. Before they can reap their rewards, they have to paddle a long way overnight to the next market where the buyers will pick up their treasures. We left the village at 10 in the evening to come here and arrived at 3 o'clock in the morning. If you should find shell money for sale on the internet, remember, it has come a long way. It might have come via Martha, Hamily, Jowlin and Lena, the raw material delivered via canoe overnight. And since it is unlikely that you will ever meet them, they are thankful for your purchase.